Hey guys, it's Carl with Electric Bike Blog, and I'm here at my tiny house, and I'm going to talk about how I'm going to use the Cybertruck that I ordered to power this tiny house and have it be totally off-grid 100% all the time. So you can see here, this is the tiny house I've been working on with my son for the past year, and I've really been enjoying this process of, uh, of doing it, and it's super insulated. Um, and here's the breaker box. So basically the plan is, is to take a standard 240 volt generator plug, and then I'm gonna punch through the wall right up here, and then uh, come into here. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wire that with this, which is a 30 amp breaker, okay? And what that does is it splits the, the 240, you get two 120s that are out of phase here, and uh, normally if you have a generator, if you had normal power, grid power, you'd want to put it up here and put it in interlock so that you can't uh, basically turn this breaker on without turning this breaker off. So that'll protect the linemen that come and try to work on your stuff when the power's out. And so uh, if the Cybertruck only has a three-prong 240 plug, this isn't going to work because you really need to have the neutral. The neutral in the ground gets tied to the bus bar. Uh, but if it's a uh, but if it's a four-prong 240, which my guess is that it will be, then you can do this and uh, it should be super easy and provide many months worth of power for the tiny house without any grid power. So. That's my ideal, and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks so much for watching.